a great way to tell if a fig is ripe if, if it basically comes off with that ease. Because if I try to pull on this one, it's not going to come off. Yeah, see? <laughs> yeah, I literally have bugs crawling all over me. Hello! So today is actually turning out to be an even more joyous day because not only are some of the grapes ready to harvest, but the figs are finally ready. Are you figging kidding me? Yes. So I've been watching these figs probably for about the last month. It had so many blooms on it. I mean, well, so many little baby figs. I'm just like waiting. When are they going to blow up? When are they going to blow up? And I already got some of them taken care of and off the tree. But yeah, no, they are awesome, decent size. They're not all ready to be harvested, but I'm going to pick as many as I can because the <laughs> birds love to get them. I know. They're, 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 awesome. these, they're pretty good size. Yeah. Oh we were God. literally just talking about them last night with a couple of friends. I was like, yeah, I know. I hate our figs because they don't get any bigger than like that, you know. But I have been proven wrong because they are pretty decent size. So. I'm going to go keep mowing. Okay. Yep, Jeremiah's going to keep mowing the lawn. And now I'm moving on to the fig tree. Let me show you what that looks like. Here is the fig tree. It's on the side of Jeremiah's parents' house. And Jeremiah was so gracious enough to bring the ladder to me. Here, see, so we do have some that are close to the ground that are ready to pick. Here is one. Here's another one. Oh, yeah, this side. I'm trying to keep track. Ah, see, so yeah, here, here's a casualty. The one that's already got bitten into. Yeah, so you definitely have to move quickly with these figs. Okay, here's another, here's another casualty. It got bitten into. And there's literally still so much left that's like not even ripe yet. Oh, look at the inside of that. And there's a little ant enjoying itself. <laughs> beautiful, absolutely beautiful. There's two in the same spot. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, look at those. Look at those beautiful babies. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, I'll probably be harvesting from this tree over the next probably two to three weeks. Yeah. Alright, I think it's time for me to climb up on the ladder again. Alright, so I'm like halfway up the tree and here are some beauteous figs. Ready? Ah! Gosh, dang it, I dropped it. Hopefully it's still in one piece. Yes. Little minor casualty. So it's best is a two-hand job. So I won't film too much longer. Okay, here's a nice looking one right here. And here's a and here's a bunch right here. Okay, so I am all done harvesting the figs for right now. I got a decent amount, but this is just the very, very, very beginning. There's still tons of figs that have yet to ripen. I'm actually just going to leave the ladder here because I'm sure I'll be back in like a, probably half a week and I don't have any use for the ladder until then. But yeah, no, I'm gonna definitely have to preserve these figs because I feel like by the time they actually ripen on the tree to, well, when they're ripe off the tree and when you pick them, it's just like another like day or two and they start to go bad. So 
definitely gonna have to preserve these ASAP and I'll probably do another fig update. Ooh, the tree actually looks pretty good from back there. But yeah, so I'm gonna take care of these and I'll probably do another update slash fig harvest in a week or two. So see you next time. Take care, bye. Thank you.